Hello, I'm Sadie. Currently I'm a PhD student here at King's in nanotechnology. I completed my undergraduate studies here and graduated with an MSci in chemistry. Undergraduate chemistry students spend most of their lab time here in the Franklin Wilkins building at Waterloo campus. The building is named after Morris Wilkins and Rosalind Franklin, who were instrumental in making crucial contributions to the discovery of the structure of DNA in the 1950s. These labs were refurbished in 2016 our facilities are fully equipped with the state-of-the-art technology and are fully integrated for all types of chemistry. Join us on a journey around our facilities. The reason I chose to study chemistry at King's, King's is a massive university in terms of research. I've always preferred chemistry because it's right down to the nitty-gritty, so I chose King's because I like the way it's run. This is our main teaching lab, so this is where you're going to do your labs in first year, second year and third year. This is called a rotary evaporator, and so what this does, it creates a vacuum and it will lower the boiling point of that solvent so you can burn it off essentially. This is just a melting point machine. Um, you're going to make a lot of uh, solid samples in your year at chemistry. Um, and so one way to analyse your sample is to look at the melting point. You can do multiple samples at once. So these are just one of our Hume hoods. This is where usually if you're going to do a dangerous reaction or anything cancerous, volatile, you'll be in these Hume hoods quite a lot. Right now we're in the instrument room. The instrument room is essentially where all your analysis takes place. You have loads of computers around on the side to compare with reference data, for example. So I chose King's mainly because it is a world-renowned university. Um, the lecturers are super into their fields, they're very, very high up. I feel like because also particularly my course is a, quite a small course, we ha can have quite a personal relationship with all the lecturers. A highlight is actually the other students being able to revise together. You learn way better and way more effectively if you get a friendship group together. I would definitely say chemistry is a course for people who want to be proactive in research essentially. After you finish this degree, you can go into so many different career options. It's not completely just set in stone with chemistry. I've had friends who have gone into teaching, law, medicine. It's a very, very good course. <laughs>